We've been populating a couple more of these badges here, and uh, I know that we can use them as touch sensors as I showed in the previous video underneath the uh, engineer and serial. You can see the two copper pads. But uh, I was curious, can these things be used as a Fontana? The answer is yes. In a previous video on the internet, somebody used an AT8085 to be an FM transmitter, and I'm doing basically a, a very similar thing by modulating OSC Cal and putting it into the oscillator and getting about an 11.25 megahertz signal out, using a PLLX8 to bump it up to about 90 megahertz, and the video, other video just had them tuning into this frequency right here. What I found though is that you can use timer 1 to output about a third of this and it produces a really, really nasty wave with tons and tons of harmonics and really just nasty signal. A lot of that is right at 90 megahertz, which is what I'm going to be tuning into. So this right now is just programmed to play a, a really simple sort of chip tuny thing. It's it's one of the, the really simple C programs. It's like a line long. And, um, and that generates a sound. And then I use the OSC cal and all that to modulate the signal. So I'm going to go turn on this radio here. It's tuned to about the right frequency. Maybe I have to tune a little bit more. And right now, the Funtenna on this AT Tiny 85 is transmitting to this clock radio here. And you can see that I can get it a long ways away, and it still transmits pretty well. Like, it's out of the picture here, but it doesn't seem to, to really go down very much. So I guess it means that there's enough power and enough nasty harmonics coming out that it comes through crystal clear. Well, just one more useless thing you can do with these useless MAGFest badges.